Kahn's syndrome. It is uh, an aldosterone secreting tumor. Uh, it's it's the location of it is in the um, adrenal cortex, the uh, zona glomerulosa. The tumor increases the production of aldosterone level. It's increased the secretion of aldosterone production and secretion of aldosterone. So aldosterone. What aldosterone does is that it's gonna go to the kidney, and it's gonna like increase the sodium reabsorptions. It increase sodium reabsorptions and uh, sodium chloride reabsorptions, which leads to an increase in the absorptions of uh, water because water will go wherever uh, sodium goes so when you reabsorb more sodiums more water gonna reabsorb into the blood so then we have hypertensions due to high el uh, hyper uh, hypertensions will lead to a decrease in the renin's activity decrease in the productions of renin's because now we have or uh, high blood pressure, decrease in renin productions. Aldosterone also does is uh, increase in the uh, basically uh, potassium and hydrogen ions have the opposite effects as uh, sodiums in the uh, kidney. When there's a, an increase in reabsorption of sodium, there would be a, de a decrease or a loss of so, uh, pot potassium and um, hydrogen in the urines, which leads to hypokalemia and which also leads to metabolic alkalosis. In hypokalemia, uh, hypokalemia would lead to uh, fatigue. would also lead to uh, muscle weakness and occasional headaches. The treatments for Kahn's uh, syndromes is uh, we use aldosterone uh, uh, blocker or antagonist which is spironolactones or aplerinones and uh, these would the side effect of these uh, is gynecomastia. So, spironolactone is more likely to cause uh, to cause gynecomastia. Uh, Aplerinol is a newer drug and it causes less, which is about like one percent, whereas uh, spironolactone would cause roughly nine percent of the cases. <sighs> That's, uh, that's basically it. So to recap it all, aldosterone causes the reabsorption of sodium and water, um, sodium and water and wasting potassium. So sodium and water cause hypertension and it causes a wasting of potassium and hydrogen ions uh, at the distal portion of the nephrons leading to hypokalemia and alkalosis. Additionally, inappropriately high aldosterone will suppress the renin's activity as part of the feedback inhibition loop. The treatments for unilateral adenoma secreting aldosterone is or is found in this patients with Kahn's syndrome. Can be either surgical resections or uh, by uh, so you could. Uh, surgical resect the, uh, the the tumor or you could use medical therapy with aldosterone antagonists which is either spironolactone or pleronomes. <laughs>